Popular Nigeria crossdresser James Brown is back to his country, is back to Nigeria. So you people should get ready for his wahala. And then um, I know some of you have missed him, especially his fans. So James Brown, whose real name is James Chukweze Obialo, made a journey to the United Kingdom, not for cruise, not for flexing, but for studies. He traveled in February, spending just three months in the United Kingdom. James Brown claimed he sponsored himself to a university in the United Kingdom when he celebrated his um, 22nd birthday. You may be asking, what took James Brown to the United Kingdom? Well, guys, he said on his 22nd birthday that he decided to give himself a sound education and back to the classroom, sponsoring himself to study in a university. He said, although he never mentioned the name of the university, he said he never stopped dreaming of the impossible because earlier this year he made a decision to support himself as he was faced with the biggest obstacles in his life. So guys, to cut the story short, James Brown is back to Nigeria and guess what? He was welcomed with an executive car and by his people, his fans, at the airport before he then find his way to, the, to his apartment. Okay guys, so the moral lesson in this, no matter the critics, no matter the judgment, no matter how I'm or uh, uh, the negative things that people say about you, just be who you are. I'm not saying James Brown, who is a cross-dresser, is winning the people's heart or is doing the right thing. What I'm saying is that despite the negative talks about him, he keeps doing what he likes and knows best because he knows the sky is not just the millimeter but the starting point. So welcome back, Princess of Africa, <laughs> Oga James Brown. We all know that you are a full man, okay? So guys, thank you for watching to the end. Please like this video and make sure you are subscribed to this channel. Have a good day.